Hey there, Chad Bonger here for Ohio University Libraries. We're doing market research on restaurant consumers or people who eat at particular casual dining or, or sit down restaurants. You'll definitely want to look at Media Mark Reporter or MRI. This video is going to show you how to use Media Mark Reporter to find consumer demographics of people who eat out at particular types of restaurants as well as people who eat out at specific brands of restaurants, for example, Applebee's or or Chili's or places like that. So once again, this video shows you how to use Media Mark Reporter to find demographic information for restaurant consumers. So here you go. So when you arrive at the home page for MRI Plus or Media Mark Reporter, you'll notice there is an existing user's login box here. If you've never used MRI Plus, you must go over here and register for free right here before you can use it. Do not try to log in here with your Ohio email address because it won't work. You want to register for free here. Definitely use your Ohio email address, but use whatever password you want. I actually, you know, here I'm using my Ohio email address, but I'm using a, a, a non Ohio U uh, password just because I like to change my OU password from periodically. So I'm going to log in as me again. You want to log in as you after you register right here. So I'm going to log in as me. And once I log in, I'm going to actually ignore everything on the page right here and go directly to Media Mark Reporter because that's what I'm primary af primarily after for the for the market research uh, consumer demographic information for um, for the restaurant market. So I'm going to click on Media Mark Reporter. It's going to take us to a page like this. Uh, if you scroll down, use the accept. All right. And you get to a page like this, and you're like, what in the world do I do now? Uh, what we're going to do is click on the fall 2013 product. Because this is an academic subscription, it's one year behind the, the regular information. So we have from 20, this, is, this video is made in 20, uh, first of the year in 2015. So we have fall 2013 data. So we'll click there. And so now you can go down and look for information on your, on your topic. So I want to go in and like, I'm just going to search for um, Applebee's. Okay. That's a restaurant, a casual dining restaurant, sit-down restaurant. I'm going to do a search for Applebee's. And you can see uh, they actually put Applebee's in leisure sports category. Okay, So now we found Applebee's. We found information for, for people who, um, who eat at Applebee's. Okay? And the way you read this, this says of all adults uh, who bought at, this is all adults bought it at last six months at Applebee's. So it's people who have eaten at Applebee's in the last six months. So what this tells you, uh, it says, of the total adult population in the U.S. of, um, of 235.5 million people, or a million people, all right, 55 million of them are projected to have eaten an Applebee's in the last six months, which is 23.7 percent of the of the total adult population. Okay, this column here is going to remain the same whether we're looking at Applebee's or Hardee's or McDonald's or whatever because this is the base population here. Okay, What's not going to remain the same is the projected all the way over. Okay, So here we see um, of those who bought at Applebee's uh, in the last six months, okay, uh, 9,000 of them were age 18 to 24. Okay, So that's pretty cool. Now what you can do here is you, in order to identify your core customer, I'm just going to use the age bracket here as well. I'm going to say, of all those people who ate at Applebee's in the last six months, let's scroll down. I'm going to find this percentage down. Okay. And this is big right here. Okay. So I'm looking at percentage down. 19% is higher than 16, then 17, 17, and 14. Okay. So it says, of all those people who ate at Applebee's in the last six months, 19% of them were aged 25 to 34. So that tells me, just based on this age category right here for Applebee's, that that is the target market right there. Um, that, that's, that's, a, that's the ideal consumer is the 25 to 34 year old for Applebee's. Not so much for the 55 to 64 year old crowd, right? There's a little bit of difference there, okay? As you scroll down, you can see there's all kind of information down here. Household income, right, looks like, uh, you know the 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 upper middle class are definitely uh, the 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 consumers of um, primary consumers of Applebee's there. Okay, and you can scroll down. You can see other house information, home value, all that kind of good stuff. Okay, now if you want to find additional reports on the restaurant market, you notice this this is in category here, leisure sports. Let's go back and do a new database, fall 2013. Here is leisure sports. And here we have family restaurants and steakhouses, okay? 
And then we have general information on who eats out at families, uh, family restaurants and steakhouses. There's our Applebee's once again, same information. Okay, and if we scroll down, here's like um, uh, Bob Evans, right? And if we go down here is Chili's Bar and Grill, things like that, okay? Now if we want to, we can compare Chili's Bar and Grill to Applebee's, to Cracker Barrel, or whatever. All we have to do is click on Chili's Bar and Grill, add to your reports. This is one of the reasons they make you log in and create an account. Let's do it. Let's do that with Carabas. Add your reports. All right, and we'll scroll up and let's do Applebee's because that was our initial one. We'll do that. Add your reports. So what you can do now, if you go up here and click on View Report List, this will give us all the information we have there. If we want to, and click on Spreadsheet. And this will generate a spreadsheet with us that we can open in Microsoft Excel. And so once you open your report, what you'll see, for example, here we have the 18 to 20, or the 25 to 34 crowd, excuse me. Uh, let's see, according to this, uh, this is Chili's. 21.3% of, of those who ate at Chili's are age 25 to 34. Again, that's pretty substantial there. Uh, here we have Carabas, 21.4%. So it looks like the 25 to 34 market is uh, is pretty ideal for all three of these restaurants. So you can find commonality and trends uh, in in a report like this, as well as differences in in different restaurants and things like that. Okay. Now, if we had changed this and looked at maybe Bob Evans, Bob Evans might skew to a slightly older crowd. So we could look at um, uh, the same kind of information in in a variety of uh, restaurants and, and kind of identify uh, demographic trends based upon restaurant preferences and things like that. So yes, MRI is a great tool for looking at demographics and consumer trends for particular products and activities. Uh, you can use it not only for restaurants, but for, for, but for lots of different other uh, product and consumer categories. Hope this video helps you. Should you need more help, look for the contact link on the business blog. Be glad to help you in way I can. Take care and good luck with your research.